Welcome to Mark Reed 757 and this is my weight loss journey. Today is uh, meal, kind of Monday meal talk to and also the journey to health collab uh, week number six. Anyway with the, the meal talk I've been eating way way different I mean I was feeling real lightheaded I had the AFib going on and uh, I was just I don't know I'd have head brushes I haven't had so many head brushes. In fact, I'm going to try tonight because I'm going disc golfing and I want to see how I do there. Because um, that's where I really, really found out about the head brushes. Uh, I believe it might have something to do with the new medicine that I'm on. It seems to be working for the most part. But uh, I am going to be having like a procedure done. I believe it's called a cryoablation where they go in through my arteries to my heart and freeze some heart muscle fibers that cause the AFib and that will in turn uh, make it so I will no longer have AFib which I'm really looking forward to I don't go for that until June 13th anyway wish me luck on there uh, as far as the meal planning though or the meal the meals that I've been eating I've been do I was doing really 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 good and then on the weekend I did you know Friday I had the steak dinner because my boss promised me a steak dinner after I got down to 350 which I did not only did I get down to the 350 but I actually got down to 341 and I think I gained about eight or nine pounds over the weekend from that so I'm not back up to 350 yet uh, however it's really really close I got to get back on track. Um, my exercises haven't really been up to par. Uh, I've just been, I, I was, I, I had this crazy notion that maybe if I ate a little bit more, the head rushes would go away, which I do feel better. But I, I honestly believe that it's not so much me eating more that makes the head rushes go away. I think it's just my body getting used to the medicine. Anyway, we'll see what happens with that. Now back to the journey to health collab. Uh, the question for this week was, how do you reward yourself when you hit a goal you set in your journey? Well, I recently had the steak dinner. However, I normally don't reward myself with food goals. Uh, I normally reward myself with stuff that I've been wanting, and they also kind of happen to be stuff that helps me along my journey. For instance, uh, you know, I have a Fitbit that I'd like to get. And once I reach a certain goal, then I'll get it. I have uh, a new camera that I'd like to get because I'd like to be able to record some of the meals that I make. I'll get it. Or I think instead of the camera, I think I'm going to get just a new uh, phone and then have some accessories with it that it will help help me, like, like a little mini tripod or something that the phone will sit in. But anyway, that's besides the point. Um... That's how I'm going to be uh, rewarding myself. Anyway, I know I've been a little lackadaisical on the videos. I've been a little lackadaisical on eating over the weekend. I've been a little lackadaisical on exercising. Uh, it's time to step back up, uh, get going, because I'm feeling a little bit better. and I can't wait till that appointment till I am able to have that procedure done for the AFib. And I'll be talking to you soon. Thank you. Have a good one.